The origins of a legend are born by witnesses that describe a miraculous event, extraordinary strength, supernatural risk, and or devout faith. The case of Welshman Bernie Williams is no exception. As a detective, my job is to interpret the facts. And in this case, there are plenty. So, little lady, what can you tell me about Bernie Williams? Oh my God. Bernie is so, you know, All right, settle down. Just tell me what you saw. Well, sir, I was, I was staring up recently, and, and uh, I, I, I do that when I've been drinking. And this, anyways, I see this, uh, this unidentified uh, flying thing, and and it's, it's a spinning and, and a floating, and uh, I gotta sit down. Well, Doc, what have you got for me? After reviewing Bernie's lab results, we found an extra Y chromosome, which most badasses have. We also found that he has the adrenal capacity of a small African bush elephant. In heat. <laughs> I hear you've known Bernie for a long time. Ah, Bernie and I grew up in Cardiff, Wales. He was the only kid who rode a motorcycle to school wearing a cape? Ma'am, what's your side of this story? I've ridden some mean machines before. Always on top. But nothing comes close to what I saw Bernie do. Okay, you're not new to this. What can you tell me? Hell, I've been around some pretty tough guys before. But Bernie? He's nobody's bitch. Wow! I mean... Hmm. This Bernie Williams legend is not unlike that of Bigfoot, the Loch Ness Monster, or even King Arthur. The only difference I can tell is that you can see it with your own eyes. Hmm. I gotta go check this out for myself before this sexy, cape-wearing, flying miracle of adrenaline strikes again.